Sometimes updating the BIOS may solve a lot of issues and problems, but not always. It may turn out that the laptop worked better on old version of the BIOS. Seriously. Today I will show you how to downgrade the BIOS using the example of Dell 3400 laptop. This method will work on most Dell laptops. Importantly, some laptops lose the ability to downgrade after updating the BIOS to the latest newer version. So keep that in mind. Before starting, everything you do and repeat today will be at your own risk. So please charge the laptop to 100% and of course connect it to charger it's very important. So let's get it started. So fellas, let's get into it. As you can see, this is Dell 3400 laptop. This laptop is quite new because it has Intel Core i3 processor of a generation. So it support Windows 11 officially. Firstly, we need to get serial number. And for this, we will use CMD. So we need to hit Win key. This is Win key plus R. Then you need to type next WMIC BIOS get serial number WMIC BIOS get serial number and hit enter. After this process, you will see your serial number of your laptop. Now you need to copy serial number. So I will select serial number and hit Ctrl plus C. Ctrl plus C. Great. After this process, we can close the command line and open our browser. It doesn't matter which browser you will use. For example, I will use Google Chrome browser. Then you need to type next Dell drivers. Don't worry, all links I will leave in the video description. Then you need to navigate to this website, Drivers and Downloads. Click on it. Of course, it will depend on your region. In the Identify your product, we need to paste our serial number. So click here and hit Ctrl plus V. Great, this is serial number of this laptop. And then just hit Enter. Voila, as you can see, this is Dell Attitude 3400 laptop. We need to scroll down a little bit. We have an option to automatically install all drivers, but we need to downgrade our BIOS. So for this, we need to click here, scroll down a little bit. Importantly, to select our current operating system. So here we see Windows 10, but we have Windows 11. So I will select Windows 11. In the categories, you need to find BIOS. Here we have only one option, BIOS. Scroll down a little bit. And as you can see, at the moment, we have an option to download the latest version of BIOS, but we want to downgrade our BIOS. In this case, we need to click here we need to find older versions. Click here. If you take a close look, you can see the versions from 2023 and even from 2022. And by the way, from 2021, etc. For example, I want to downgrade to this version 1.26.0. So I just need to click on it. No, thanks. Also, we have a message, do not turn off your computer or disconnect from the power source while updating the BIOS. It's very important and, of course, at the beginning of the video, I told it. From this place, scroll down a little bit until you will see download. So you can click here. We successfully downloaded the BIOS, the older version. Now we can open it in folder and you can close the browser. No need to use it anymore. However, I want to note one very important thing. Sometimes on some laptops, on Dell, on Asus or even on Acer, you don't have such an option to downgrade. For some reason, after updating to the new version, this option locked and you cannot downgrade to the older versions. So keep that in mind. Now we just need to click on this file. And before doing this, please charge your laptop to 100% and please connect your laptop to a charger. It's very important. Now we can run this file. Double click on it. Select yes. 
as you can see the current version is 1.33.0 and the newer actually the older version is 1.26.0 we can clarify and select update as you can see we have a message that we want to downgrade to the older version click ok after this process we need to restart the system that's not all be patient and take your time now we need to click on restart Probably this is one of the most important moments of this video, the flashing process. Do not press any button, do not shut down the power, do not disconnect charger from the laptop. Be patient, take your time until this process finish. As you can see laptop successfully restarted, we downgraded BIOS to the older version. However, I want to know that this process may take some time and it will depend on your laptop. So sometimes it may take one or two or even five minutes. In that case, as I said before, you just need to be patient and take your time. My conclusions. No matter how it sounds, but downgrade it's not always a bad thing. But please be careful. If this video was helpful, please like it. You can support the channel by buying something from the links in the video description. Also, I recommend watching this video on how to update BIOS on Dell laptops.